It is 13 minutes after 5 o'clock, and while we got some much-needed moisture yesterday, look at this snowpack map. It is still not enough. We are only at 75% of where we should be this average time of year, and Denver Parks and Rec just announcing, as a result, it's going to keep all athletic fields closed for the next few weeks due to these dry conditions. Well, Lindsay Sablon is live at one of those parks. Lindsay? Yeah, Anna, it does seem a little bit weird to say they're having issues with drought when we see snow on the ground, but that is exactly the case. Like you mentioned, we are well below average. So any fields like this that have natural grass or turf, you're looking at the bleachers that are covered by snow, but any fields like this are going to be closed at least through March 18th. Now, this is just one of more than 100 athletic parks that are going to be affected by this. What the Parks Department is hoping is by restricting access now, it won't damage these fields later on this spring into summertime. So baseball fields and softball fields like this open up March 18th. All other athletic fields will be open April 1st. Now, if you're caught going into these fields while they're closed, you could be cited or get a hundred dollar fine. So they are taking it very seriously. Parks Department and Ranger Parks are going to be out here monitoring the fields. They say they hope to open up March 18th or April 1st, but if the conditions continue to worsen, it may be pushed back even later. Live in Denver, Lindsay Sablon, 7 News.